Gulab jamun is a popular Indian sweet made from deep-fried dough balls soaked in a sugar syrup. It's a delightful dessert that's enjoyed on various occasions. Here's a basic recipe to make gulab jamun. Ingredients For the dough balls, jamuns 1. 1 cup milk powder 2. 1 quarter cup all-purpose flour, maida 3. 1 quarter teaspoon baking soda 4. 2 3 tablespoons ghee, clarified butter 5. A pinch of cardamom powder 6. A small amount of milk, for kneading, if needed. For the sugar syrup, chashni. 1. 2 cups sugar. 2. 1 cup water. 3. A few saffron strands, optional. 4. 1 quarter teaspoon cardamom powder. 5. 1 teaspoon rose water, optional. Instructions. Prepare the sugar syrup. 1. In a saucepan, combine sugar and water to make the sugar syrup. 2. Heat over medium heat until the sugar dissolves completely. 3. Add saffron strands and cardamom powder to the syrup. 3. You can also add rose water for flavor. 4. Allow the syrup to boil for about 5-7 minutes until it becomes slightly sticky. 4. Once it reaches a one-string consistency, remove it from heat and set aside. Prepare the dough. 1. In a mixing bowl, combine milk powder, all-purpose flour, baking soda, and cardamom powder. 2. Add ghee and mix well. 2. The mixture should resemble breadcrumbs. 3. Gradually add a little milk and knead gently to form a soft and smooth dough. 3. Be careful not to over-knead. 4. Let the dough rest for about 10-15 minutes. Shape and fry the jamuns. 1. Heat oil or ghee in a deep frying pan over medium-low heat. 2. While the oil heats up, divide the dough into small portions and roll them into smooth balls. 2. Ensure there are no cracks on the surface of the balls, as they might break while frying. 3. Once the oil is ready, you can test by dropping a small piece of dough, it should sizzle and rise, lower the heat to low and carefully add the dough balls. 3. Make sure not to overcrowd the pan. 4. Fry the balls, turning them gently to ensure even browning, until they turn golden brown. 4. This should take about 5-7 minutes. 4. Keep the flame low to ensure the jamuns cook evenly from the inside as well. Soaking the jamuns. 1. Once the jamuns are cooked, remove them from the oil using a slotted spoon and drain any excess oil. 2. Immediately place the hot jamuns into the prepared sugar syrup. 2. They should be hot when placed in the syrup so that they absorb it well. 3. Allow the jamuns to soak in the syrup for at least 1-2 hours before serving. 3. During this time, they will absorb the syrup and become soft and juicy. Serving 1. Serve the gulab jamuns warm or at room temperature. 1. They can be enjoyed on their own or with a scoop of vanilla ice cream. Remember that making perfect gulab jamuns might take a bit of practice, especially getting the right texture for the dough and achieving the proper consistency for the sugar syrup. But with time, you'll be able to master this delicious dessert.